Okay, I'm gonna try to do a video vlog. I tried to do one last night, but uh, my memory card was full because I'd sung a bunch of songs and it was full. I had no more room to, to even do a video vlog. The time I got home, we got everything off of it. I just didn't feel like doing one. Just didn't feel like doing one. And then I was I was too tired to even upload. I only got two uploads. I got like 12 songs at home I need to upload. Hello. But uh, <clears throat> okay, Friday. Friday's a pretty decent day. Okay, I only worked, I actually worked about six hours and made like 90 bucks. Okay, I uh, took crap loads of breaks and sat around at work doing nothing pretty much the whole night. But I still made 90 bucks. Uh, Saturday, got up. I was like bored. I'm like, damn it, I'm gonna go see a movie. So you know what I did? I went and seen a movie. I went and watched that movie Wanted. Okay. Pretty good movie. So, pretty good movie. I liked it. It was awesome. A couple parts in there, I was like, yeah, nope, that's, no, no. I, too far, you reached a little too far. But, it was still a good movie. Loved it. Afterwards, I've already got my drink. It's free refills. I'm like, holy smokes, let's watch another movie. So, I was like, man, what do I want to watch? What do I want to watch? Nothing else really spoke to me. So, I was like, you know what? This movie looks cute, looks fun, looks funny. I'm going to watch it. So I watched the movie Wall-E. About the little robot. It's like a cartoon. Don't, don't, don't. Nothing wrong with the cartoon. It's by Pixar Animations, and they are awesome. Pixar movies rock, dude. They rock. All right? So I watch it, and the, what I like about Pixar movies is before the movie, when you go to theaters, they play like a little cartoon. That has nothing to do with the movie. It's just a, just a cartoon. A funny little cartoon. I remember being a kid and you go to the movies and they'd always play a cartoon before the movies. Like the drive-in or this or that or something. And that was just cool, man. That was cool. So, I, it, it's just cool that they do that. I think that's awesome. But anyway, the, uh, this is funny. Because uh, one reason why I want to see it is the, the robot kind of reminds me of a shorter version. Like someone squished down the robot from Short Circuit. Remember that movie? Uh-huh. Showing my age a little bit. It's got Steve Gutenberg in there and Ali Sheedy. Good movie. Good movie. But it's got the robot. His name is number five and he's like alive. So, yeah. Good movie. You should totally check that out. Okay, right up here ahead. Let me get this over here. Let me show you this. See that? Hooker. She's a hooker. I guarantee you. She's a hooker. Yep. She's a hooker. There you have seen a hooker. I should totally pull up and be like, hey. Just so I could get it on videotape. That'd be awesome. But I don't think I'm going to do that. But I just, you know, whatever. I, I don't get them. But, uh, yeah, I took this off there just so you could see the hooker. I don't know if you got to see the hooker. But, yeah, she's a hooker. I see her out here like every freaking night when I'm on my way home. And I'm on my way home. But, uh, okay, where was I? Uh, pulled over a so I could do this. Uh, where was it? Oh, yeah. So, yeah, that movie, Short Circuit, was an awesome movie. I really enjoyed that movie. And after that, I didn't know what else to do, so I just went home. I went home. And I played on the Internet a little bit, kind of chilled, relaxed. Uh, didn't do much of nothing. Watched a little TV. And then me and Jeremy and Jamie, we went to go eat. We went to we went to the old place where I used to work. It's called Mi Amigos. It's like a Mexican restaurant, but it's more like American um, Mexican. It's not authentic Mexican food. It's like Americanized, but it's good. I kind of miss working there sometimes. It, it was fun. I had fun working there. So that's cool. But yeah, no, I you know it was pretty good food. I, I enjoyed it. So, but we always order too much. Have to bring a bunch of food home. So, but okay, now Sunday. What happened Sunday? Sunday, went to work, worked all day. It was a long day. Busy ass day. Busy ass day. And, uh, made a, I made about, I, mean, I think I made 130 bucks on Sunday, which rocked. I love making 130 bucks. There goes the hooker again. You know that she's a hooker. You know how, okay, this is how you know if they're a hooker. If you're ever wondering, you're driving down the street in a ghetto neighborhood, okay? If a girl is walking down the street and she's not a hooker, she will not, I repeat, she will not make eye contact with every 
passing car. She'll keep her eyes ahead and she'll walk and go where she's going. A hooker, every time a car passes by, they stop what they're doing or they glance over and they make eye contact with every car. They're like, that's how you know. They're doing the eye contact. And when I drive home, usually, man, unless I'm doing this, I'm like, there's one, there's one. Dude, I'm like, I'm like tunnel vision. Tunnel vision. All right? Like I got blinders on the side of me. Because if you look at them, then they think you want something. And this one makes it worse. Okay, we deliver a lot in this, in like around here where these hookers are all the time. So they'll see me drive down, deliver a pizza on the street, and then I come driving back. So they'll like jump out there like, hey, because they think I'm coming back for them. I'm not coming back for you, hooker. Do I look like I'm pulling over and saying, hey, hooker? No, I'm not. Okay, I'm delivering a damn pizza, hooker. But no, hooker got to get in the way. And she wants me to do some hooking with her. But I don't want to do no hooking with the hooker. Screw that, man. I don't want to get HIV, syphilis, uh, gonorrhea, the crabs, the clap. I don't know. Chlamydia. I don't know. What all? Son of a bitch. I ain't got no parking spot, man. This is bullshit. Damn it. People need to learn how to park. They park and they take up like two spots. Everybody takes up two spots. Well, instead of parking like five cars in this one little area, we get to park like three. It's bull crap. Okay, where was I? Sitting out in front of the opposite side of my house, the street. Whatever. But, so anyway, anyway. Uh, so, yeah, I didn't get to do a video blog last night because my thing was dead. Uh, let's see. Tonight I go to work. And this is awesome because our, my boss is on vacation. Uh, I guess they left, who knows when, probably Sunday morning. So, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, the four days that I work, they're gone. Bye. And their daughter, Ashley, who is fun. She's fun to work with. I like working with Ashley. She's working right now. So, that's awesome. And then they come back on Thursday, but I'm gone. So, that's... I didn't get to see him Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, or Thursday. That's six days. That's almost a week's vacation from them. Awesome. It's good to get away from the boss man every while and then. Okay, what else? Oh, I had a massive nosebleed. I mean, it was just like gushing and gushing and gushing. I was like, what the hell? I mean, I think I lost a pound of blood. Yeah, probably. So, cost sixty dollars to fill my car up. That's some bullshit right there. Sixty dollars, man. So sixty bucks. Uh, what else? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm drawing a mind blank. A mind blank. A mind blank. Uh, I don't know. But yeah, I worked tonight. I, tonight wasn't as good as yesterday. I made like 115 bucks. Here's it. Oh, this is annoying me, man. Okay, yesterday I made 130 bucks, but I should have made almost 150. I was $16 under my average per delivery, like for the whole night. If you had up all my tips, divide it all out. I made $16 less than I should have in just tips because people weren't tipping. Okay, how do you not tip? Tonight I made like six or seven dollars less than I should have. No, actually six. I made twelve dollars less tonight than I should have. Okay, if you had those two up for two, that's thirty dollars in two days that I should have had, but I don't because you no know, twenty-eight. I can't add it. Twenty-eight dollars less. That's bull crap. How are you gonna take? I take a delivery up to these people, and they're like, "We want our twenty cent." I'm like, "Well, I don't have twenty cents on me. I have to go to the store." They're like, okay, what? You really? You want me to waste gas to go drive to the store, get changed, and bring you 20 cents because you're too cheap to tip 20 cents? Loser! So, anyway, I think this is going to be too long, so I'm getting off here. I'm going to go in. See ya. Bye.